And this is where Tanzu Mission Control comes in. And this is where I start to get really excited. Because what you're looking at here is the Kubernetes clusters being managed across multiple public clouds. You've got Amazon, Microsoft Azure, Google, and VMware here, all in one view. And it's as easy as clicking to create a new cluster in any of those clouds from this console. At the same time, these apps are arranged into namespaces. And if we look at the namespaces here, you'll see a list of all the applications we've gotten. It's really easy to go and create a new namespace for something like Tanzu Tees. Now here, you'd say, OK, in this namespace, we're going to be allowed to use these public clouds. Yep. So again, we're making it very, very easy for people to start to use multiple clouds with multiple Kubernetes clusters, but from one console and in one place. But actually, the real kicker here is about policy. And so let me show you how someone would do policy today. And what you're seeing here is all the consoles for all the Kubernetes offerings across all the public clouds. So to go and set policy, you'd have to go to each of these, multiple CLIs, there's you know, web interfaces, all manner of stuff you'd have to do to do this. But let's come back to the demo with Tanzu Mission Control and show you how we do that today with Mission Control. It's as simple as clicking to add a role and then setting it up and click Done, and you can start to deploy automatically across all of those clouds.